The current time is 11.47 a.m. Eastern Daylight Time. Now the official National Weather Service forecast for the Champlain Valley, which includes Burlington, Middlebury, St. Albans, and Plattsburgh. Rest of today, partly sunny late this morning, then cloudy with a chance of showers this afternoon. Highs in the upper 70s. South winds 10 to 15 miles an hour. Chance of rain 50%. Tonight, cloudy with a slight chance of thunderstorms. A chance of showers until midnight, then showers likely after midnight. Some thunderstorms may produce gusty winds and heavy rainfall. Humid with lows in the mid-60s. South winds 15 to 20 miles an hour with gusts up to 30 miles an hour. Chance of rain 70%. Sunday, partly sunny. A chance of showers in the morning. Less humid with highs in the lower 70s. Southwest winds 15 to 20 miles an hour with gusts up to 35 miles an hour. Becoming west with gusts up to 45 miles an hour in the afternoon. Chance of rain 50%. Sunday night, clear. Patchy dense fog, lows around 50. West winds 10 to 15 miles an hour with gusts up to 25 miles an hour. Now the official National Weather Service forecast for north central Vermont and the western slopes of the Green Mountains, which includes Montpelier, Underhill, Enosburg Falls, and Stowe. Rest of today, mostly sunny late this morning, then mostly cloudy with a chance of showers this afternoon. Highs in the mid 70s. South winds 10 to 15 miles an hour. Chance of rain 50%. Tonight, cloudy. A chance of showers with a slight chance of thunderstorms until midnight. Then showers likely with a slight chance of thunderstorms after midnight. Some thunderstorms may produce heavy rainfall. Then some thunderstorms may produce gusty winds and heavy rainfall after midnight. Humid with lows in the lower 60s. South winds 10 to 15 miles an hour with gusts up to 35 miles an hour. Chance of rain 70%. Sunday, partly sunny. Showers likely, mainly in the morning. Highs around 70. Southwest winds 15 to 20 miles an hour, becoming west in the afternoon. Gusts up to 35 miles an hour. Chance of rain 70%. Sunday night, clear. Patchy dense fog, lows in the mid-40s. Northwest winds 10 to 15 miles an hour with gusts up to 25 miles an hour. Now the official National Weather Service forecast for the northern Adirondacks, which includes Lake Placid, Saranac Lake, Tupper Lake, and Anamora. Rest of today, partly sunny late this morning, then cloudy with a chance of showers this afternoon. Highs in the upper 70s. South winds 10 to 15 miles an hour. Chance of rain 50%. Tonight, showers likely with a slight chance of thunderstorms. Some thunderstorms may produce gusty winds and heavy rainfall. Humid with lows around 60. Southwest winds 15 to 20 miles an hour with gusts up to 30 miles an hour. Chance of rain 70%. Sunday, partly sunny. Showers likely in the morning. Less humid with highs in the mid-60s. West winds 15 to 20 miles an hour with gusts up to 40 miles an hour. Chance of rain 70%. Sunday night, clear. Patchy dense fog, lows in the mid-40s. West winds 10 to 15 miles an hour. And now, the extended forecast for the listening area. Monday and Monday night, clear. Patchy dense fog through the day. Highs in the lower 70s. Lows in the mid 40s. Tuesday and Tuesday night, partly cloudy. A chance of showers. Highs in the upper 70s. Lows in the lower 50s. Chance of rain 40%. Wednesday and Wednesday night, partly cloudy. A chance of showers. Highs in the mid 60s. Lows in the mid 50s. Chance of rain 50%. Thursday and Thursday night, mostly clear. Highs in the mid-60s. Lows in the mid-40s. Friday, mostly sunny. Highs in the upper 60s. Here are the 11 a.m. observations. In Burlington, it was mostly sunny. The temperature was 81 degrees with a dew point of 62, giving a relative humidity of 52%. The wind was south at 7 miles an hour. The pressure was 29.99 inches and falling. At Plattsburgh, it was cloudy. The temperature was 75 degrees and the wind was southeast at 10 miles an hour. At Colchester Reef, the temperature was 72 degrees and the average wind was south at 9 miles an hour. At Diamond Island, the temperature was 70 degrees and the average wind was southwest at 6 miles an hour. Across the rest of Vermont, it was 72 at St. Johnsbury. It was cloudy, with a temperature of 72 at Montpelier, 75 at Morrisville, 76 at Rutland, and 75 at Springfield. It was fair, with a temperature of 80 at Highgate, and 66 at Lindenville. 
in New York State, at Glens Falls, rain was falling with a temperature of 72. It was sunny with a temperature of 82 at Ogdensburg and 83 at New York City. At Saranac Lake, it was partly sunny with a temperature of 74. It was cloudy with a temperature of 78 at Messina and 77 at Watertown. In New Hampshire and Massachusetts, at Lebanon, it was mostly sunny with a temperature of 74. At Whitefield, New Hampshire, it was partly sunny with a temperature of 75. It was cloudy with a temperature of 79 at Concord and 74 at Boston. Across southern Canada, at Sherbrooke, it was sunny with a temperature of 77. It was partly sunny with a temperature of 77 at Montreal and 73 at Ottawa. In New Hampshire, on top of Mount Washington, fog was reported at the summit. The wind was southwest at 21 miles an hour and the temperature was 54 degrees. Once again, in Burlington, it was 81 degrees under mostly sunny skies. This is NOAA Weather Radio KIG-60, all hazards, broadcasting on a frequency of 162.400 MHz from the top of Mount Mansfield in northwestern Vermont. This transmitter services the counties of Addison, Chittenden, Franklin, Grand Isle, Lamoille and Washington in Vermont, in northern New York, Essex, Franklin, and Clinton counties. The current time is 11.53 a.m. Eastern Daylight Time. Now the official...